Much of the huge market for mobile devices could feel the shockwaves from Apple's billion-dollar win over Samsung in the California courtroom. CNET writer Josh Lowenson covered the month-long trial. In the world of tech, this is a really big deal because it comes down to this uh, he said, she said argument of who created something. The jury agreed that Apple created software for on-screen actions like pinching and zooming and design features like the iPhone's rounded corners and the arrangement of icons on the screen. Samsung is not the only maker of lookalikes. For a lot of other cell phone makers who have maybe similar looking devices, uh, they might have to rethink how they design phones and tablets. The verdict sharpens Apple's competition with Google, maker of the Android software that runs on many smartphones and tablets, including those made by Samsung. Android phones now outsell iPhones by three to one. Apple said the verdict sends a loud and clear message that stealing isn't right. Samsung called the verdict a loss for the American consumer, which could bring potentially higher prices. The company says it will appeal, and for now at least, the affected products will remain on the shelves. And this isn't the only legal clash between Apple and Samsung. A judge in South Korea yesterday reached a split decision in a similar patent case. The two technology giants are battling in courtrooms around the world, as well as in stores. John Blackstone, CBS News, San Francisco.